thank you all so much for coming. Uh, my name is Natasha. I'm the curator here at the gallery. Doesn't this feel like a real reception for the first time in like two years? Like, minus food, I know we still don't have food. Which, you know, it's always a big thing, but you know, we, we do what we can. So, um, I just wanted to say thank you all so much for coming and supporting Arlie. He's been so wonderful to work with, as I'm sure all of you just know. Um, the install went fantastic. Uh, thank you to Beth Jackson and Jean Allen for doing that, and, and Arlie was here as well that day helping out. Um, and it's just been a pleasure to work with Arlie, and this really is a, a milestone in his, uh, in his art career. And on behalf of the gallery and the municipality, we're just so honored that you selected our, our space to do this. And uh, we just have, I just have something for you on behalf of so a certificate of recognition um, signed by the mayor. Um, and so just on behalf of the municipality. Uh, just a Got it. Cool. First of all, uh, the board of this wonderful facility, I want to thank them, and then particularly Natasha and Emily, who've been wonderful to work with. They're very receptacle comments from me. And I would like to thank all the people that loan the work. Um, and then we're so kind enough to bring it to us. With the exception of a few pieces, all of them were hand delivered by the owners. Some of them, uh, most of them might have been seen, but the two over there, uh, the uh, Olmstead uh, Kajuas, the Olympians, and the Sports Pal have never been seen. They were commissioned work, and they were in their in the houses. And I'm particularly pleased that they were allowing us to have them here. So. Um, Thanks to Beth Jackson and um, Jean Allen. They were a dynamic duo. Um, <laughs> they put this thing together. First of all, they come in the morning. And there's a lot of work to just figuring out where things should go. Uh, it could be thematic. It could be coloration. It could be subject matter. And they came up just like magic. Everything that suited me <laughs> well, it was just so great, you know. And uh, and then I, it's sort of a family affair as well, because uh, uh, there's work uh, involving um, my daughter Tammy and uh, and Kevin, my son, did a uh, portrait of me uh, when I was out in Tofino, and. Uh, I thought I'd have it on the, uh, in the show as well as on the cover. Now, it's not here physically, but it's on the invitations. And uh, the, the picture was taken by my brother, Ben, who was out there. So I, uh, Darlene, my daughter-in-law, saved my butt. I was trying to type. <laughs> I was working for a good hour or more. She comes over in about eight minutes. And the whole thing done. I should have asked her a lot sooner. <laughs> I'm a painter, not a scout. <laughs> so, uh, anyways, I really appreciated that uh, so much. Um, we had a delivery um, group, a small group. Glenn McNichola, who's uh, a fellow painter, and um, John McNutt, uh, her son-in-law, and Darlene, my wife, and Tam, my daughter. Um, we were able to get uh, all the work here in between rain showers. And, uh, <laughs> and thanks to Natasha, we were able to bring things ahead of time and put them into storage. That made it so much easier. It's one thing to bring your own art, but it's another thing to bring somebody else's art. Yeah. Once it leaves, you know, <laughs> to give you your check or whatever you get, there's a whole different attitude about having that piece of work. So, um, anyways, it all went well, and I'm so, so happy about that. And then, um, to all my art friends, my God, there's so many, past and present, you know that played a real role in my development. 
here in North Bay. And then I had some wonderful people supporting me in Pembroke before we arrived in North Bay. But the North Bay Art Association, I've always featured them in my talks about bringing you out into the community, getting you a confidence to be out and about. And that all led to more than just being in a club or organization. It led to being a participant in arts in general in North Bay. So everybody was so welcoming in that group. And uh, I had my first exhibition under their jurisdiction. So that was great. Um, there were so many great gallery directors that I went on to put on shows, exhibitions, the Angel Project and some of these others. And they were so accommodating, let me be the curator of these shows and then support me once I made that commitment. <coughs> I've been so fortunate in that regard. And um, my daughter Tammy, she's um, played an incredible role. Um, I can't say how much. She's been a collector of my work, my biggest fan. There's a picture of her when she's two and a half years old with me uh, in our house that we had built. And she had moved into us with us uh, in my early 20s. And I'm painting a painting where I should have been painting the walls. <laughs> <laughs> I can see the, the work on, you know. Yeah, so. Um, then my wife Darlene, for many years of support and patience through the years of life issues, raising a family, working out, making extra money so that we could afford to get the house and going and that, volunteering. She's done a tremendous amount of volunteering in many uh, organizations, particularly the carousel. And she's into it with crafts and quilting. And fortunately for me, she endured a painter's eccentricity. <laughs> that is an amazing thing. Because uh, there is an innate, there was an internal drive to produce, to, to paint. And you have to understand that both things go hand in hand. The well-being and feeling of the family is paramount, but the drive to create and produce is hard to you know, put aside. And so she's allowed me to do those things. You know, I, that's so great. So we're looking at roughly 62 years of working, starting uh, with my most serious work, showing and exhibiting, in uh, Pembroke around the age of 19. And uh, then moving to North Bay, working in the health field, and um, setting aside art for a little while till I developed courses and things to do with my job. And then the Art Association opened the doors to more development in, in uh, North Bay. So thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate the uh, thought. I have uh, one other daughter, and she's been my publicity person on uh, She's on the uh, internet and uh, telling everybody about dad is having a show. <laughs> so I thank her for that as well. And my grandchildren, they're wonderful people. I think maybe some might be here. And so uh, they put up with me just to finish up. They got so sick of me taking their pictures. <laughs> Would you climb up this tree? Would you do this? <laughs> and so finally they kind of, uh, you know, that's it. <laughs> so that's it called me pop. So thank you. <laughs> Thank you.